So tell me some of the laws that you know of how to be Bible. Because we as fight? believers, we have to be doing a something. Long card. We have to know the laws of God. That is how we're supposed to delight in the Lord's will. Tell me some of the laws. You know of any of the laws? Um, you know what laws? You know. Give me one. Give me one. Pardon? You have a, you have a lot? Alright, let me give you one, sis. Ah, you mentioned love. Alright, give me the bit of cuss cut tonight. You are here in our hearts. That is right, sis. So let me show you. Let me show you what the Bible says. Because Christ said, love your neighbor as you love yourself. Good. So you know of that commandment. He also said, love the Lord thy God with all your heart. Correct? So let us see what Christ was talking about. Leviticus chapter 19 and verse 17. Uh -huh. Thou shalt not hear thy brother in thine heart. Because a lot of our people got a lot of hatred in our heart. Christ is saying nothing here, but, but where did he get that from? Read it. Read it again. Thou shalt not hear thy brother in thine heart. Uh -huh. Thou shalt in any wise rebuke thy neighbor. Uh -huh. Thou not suffer sin upon him. So you see how we ain't supposed to hit me, brothers? Uh huh. Okay, read it again. Let me guess. Sound yes, sis. Come on. Chapter 19 and verse 17. Uh huh. Thou shalt not hear thy brother in thine heart. How? How shall we not hear our brother in our heart, Rick? Thou shalt in any wise rebuke thy neighbor and not suffer sin upon him. So if we see our fellow neighbors, our brethren and sisters, and we are supposed to hit them, we have to rebuke them. Meaning, we have to correct them. That's that right. is love. Alright? Because a lot of our people do not like correction. That's right. They hate correction. That's right. If I say to you, sis, don't do this, don't do that. You know, you know what I'm saying? Oh, you're being too controlling. Right? We've been too controlling. But let me show you something now. In the same commandments that a lot of our sisters hate. Now keep in mind, this is not hate tricks, sis. This is hate tricks. Right? Read. This is the book of Deuteronomy. Chapter 22 and verse 5. Uh -huh. The woman shall not wear that which pertaineth unto a man. The woman shall not wear that which pertaineth unto a man. Neither shall a man Put on a woman's them garment. Them Neither them shall a man put on a woman's them garment. Them Tell me what I'm saying, sis. Because you but know it is true. Uh huh. Correct. Uh huh. It's true. So what happens, sis? We understand that we are in captivity. Uh huh. That we are going to. But we are supposed to live beyond life. We are supposed to live by the will of God. So if, right, if, sis, let's say for example we are in captivity and you come out, part of your uniform is for you to wear pants, right? What should you do as a believer of God and this Bible after work? What should you do? Wear the skirt, exactly, sis. So that is how we are supposed to, we are supposed to love our neighbor. Read it again for the sister. Read it right through. Deuteronomy chapter twenty-two and verse five. Uh -huh. The woman shall not wear that which pertaineth unto a man. So no woman shall be wearing a pants. Come on. That's right. Neither shall a man put on a woman's garment. Neither shall a man be in a dress or a skirt. Bring it on. For all that do so. Our abomination! Our right. abomination! Come on! Unto the Lord thy God! Unto the Lord thy God! So any cross dressing is an abomination! Right. Unto the most high God! Right. The Lord talks about the abominations of this earth! Give me Jeremiah chapter 44 and verse 4! And it's pure abominations going on on this island! Right. This is the book of Jeremiah! Verse 40, chapter 44 and verse 4. Uh -huh. Hope it, I say unto you, all my servants, the prophets. All the 
servants of God are the children of Israel. That's God is saying to you to do what? Read. Rising early and sending them, saying, Oh, do not this abominable thing that I hear God hear abominations. That's right. God does not stand for abominations. It is high time that we repent as a people come back to the most high God's laws. This is the truth according to the Bible. Bring it out. This is how we show God love. This is how we are to love our neighbors. Not doing the abominable acts. Read it again. Jeremiah chapter 44 and verse 4. Come on. How be it? I say unto you, all my servants, the prophets, uh -huh. rising early and sending them, saying, Oh, do not this abominable thing that I hear. Nation is men leading by example.